I'm going to give you all the best jump shots in NBA 2K24, how to shoot the best tips, best badges, best methods, best everything. Listen, listen, this video is very important. Make sure y'all watch the full video, man. Play with randoms all the time, good people. Everyone's struggling to shoot every 2K. Y'all was even struggling on 2K22. Watch jump shot videos, bro. Figure it out. <laughs> Watch mine. I'm going to teach you how to, you know. You will have way more fun playing the game if you learn how to shoot. Stop playing 2K if you don't take the time to learn to shoot, bro. You will be miserable. And you will be some arthritis having, not shooting capable person spamming me paragraphs on why you think I'm the reason you're having a bad experience. Now, firstly, before I get into all the jump shots, I want to show y'all this, right? Get your lethal hot zones, okay? 2K Lab did a test, right? You have to at least get your hot spots. Before you play online, get your hot spots, bro. It will be way easier to shoot on every build you use. Get your hot spots. Send this to a friend. Tell them, get your hot spots. Stop making everyone miserable to play the game because you're too lazy to get your hot spots. Get them. The lethal, these purple hot zones, you have to do the art of shooting drill. I think it's open like two times a week. Y'all uh, clarify down below. And also let me know y'all's favorite jump shots down below and uh, anything else. But, you know, but look, hot zones, very important. You have to get them. Now, look, here are the visual cues explained by Mike Wayne. I personally use release, but you can hear what he says. But look, none of this truly matters because there's so much latency. But, you know, you have to let it go before the cue of whichever one you use it's kind of crazy bro but listen up but yeah li li listen up jump is the point where your player's toes leave the floor set point is when the ball is raised up above the head before the shooting motion begins push which is the default setting is when the shooting motion is underway and the ball is being pushed forward and release is the point just before the ball leaves the shooter's hand jump is the point where your player's toes leave the floor set point is when the ball now look, the whole problem with this is there's so much latency in 2K and there's so there's different latency in so many different modes. So it's kind of hard, you know, you know, but it's still easy, right? You just got to get used to it. You know, you got to have your prediction skills up. You can't always go off the cue because there's so many different latencies. Take off trigger effect. Something should not be vibrating in your hand. You're a grown man. You feel me? Take off trigger effect on your PlayStation and on the game. You can keep on vibration. It's cool. But take off trigger effect. Throws you off. It's ridiculous. When I be playing rec, all I hear old heads, young heads, you know, just turn off your jump shot meter. I don't care if you don't know your jump shot. Figure it out. You get a 20% plus boost without the meter. Tell all your friends, share this video to them. Now look, your visual cue. I like release. I say use release or push. They say release is very late and they're saying push is late. Um, I be using release and I, I like it. They saying this is uh, whatever, but whatever. Your timing, it, just make sure you put it on push or release and then let, let me know how you feel about it. This is supposed to be very early. This is supposed to be early. This is supposed to be late. This is supposed to be very late. I like the very late, bro. But yeah, this first jump shot right here, you know, it's smooth. You know, it's, it's a guard jump shot, triple A's, decent time and stability. It's Gucci, man. Nice jump shot. Test it out. Let me know. Now look, we got the Terrence Man base, the Curry. Robinson releases, triple A again, higher defensive immunity. This one got more of a flick to it. You might have a better cue with this. Test it out, let me know what you, we got another curry base in this hole, right? <laughs> you can tell, I be going to the lab, boy. But here, here's another different release for you. You know, we got the triple A's, good time and stability. Curry right now, I'm thinking is like the best guard base. You know, y'all let me know y'all's favorite guard base. But yeah, test it out. Let me know what you think. Now look, we got the KPJ. They kind of mess with it. It's kind of weird this year. Um, here's what I got for the KP. I think this probably it's kind of inconsistent this year, but it's still, you know, you can still work with it, you know, test it out. And we got Stockton. Stockton's very good this year. You can see, you know, you, you go forward, you know, you got a nice little release cue on that hoe. 
you know, a good release height if it's like last year, you know, with the fade in, and you know, you know, it's a nice jump shot for y'all guards. We got another Curry release, a strong flick, okay? Strong flick, okay? Test them out, you know, to test out the different Curries. Let me know what, what blend y'all like. To now we got a Kyle Lowry. One's pretty decent. You could green with this hoe. Now, I do got some jump shots from the Discord, right? They, I got a big Discord. If y'all ever need people to play with, link in description. Click that hoe. And find you people to play with, people to talk to about what builds, whatever. But, yeah, uh, they sent this um, jump shot right here. They said it's pretty good, man. Check it out because I don't have a build. for. So I told them to send me some jump shots for certain builds. It's Terrence, man. It's pretty good on guard and bigs or bigger ISO builds, right? Got another one right here, at least 6'5". You know, the Cameron Johnson, Terrence, man, you know, these is looking like the new bases, man. And y'all already know Scotty Pippen was one of the uh, easy jump shots to green with last year. Here's another one, you know. Here goes another jump shot. I hate how you can't, like, make the jump shots, man. Like, you got to have the type of build. It's kind of annoying, but, you know, a screenshot of this. Here's another variation of that jump shot for, you know, you know, bigger my players this jump shot right here is hella easy to green with okay couldn't save this hole though now look your skill boost i know they're scamming us but if you want to be able to shoot <laughs> jump shot boost will help you if you want to be able to shoot also even better gatorade okay um you can probably go with one of these holes or not even use it make sure you always do your weekly workouts they took gym rat out the game if you do your weekly workouts on a certain level you're gonna get the extra blue bar that helps you with your shooting and everything you do correct very important your gatorade is going to help you shoot you, you see how they everything in the game is designed for you to be in a vc deficit we are basically paying to play the game Y'all ain't never thought about that, huh? Get your hot zone, okay? Get your hot zones. In my career, I think they transfer. Someone let me know if they transfer. Get your hot zones. Um, they have to transfer. They have to. But get your hot zones. It will change your life. Get your hot zones. A lot of y'all can't shoot. You don't have hot zones. In every 2K, you don't have your hot zones. You struggle to shoot. Have your hot zones plus your badges You'll be Gucci. Now, one more thing. In every 2K, people take all this stuff off to make it have less lag delay. You could turn off your shot feedback. You could turn off everything. If you, like, if you feel like stuff is really bothering you, if you're lag delayed, you turn all this off, it could help. I'm going to keep it on. But they say you turn all this off. You know, they be doing this in every 2K, like the stage guys. I don't know if it help or don't. The ball trail, they turn it all off. If you're experiencing stuff and you just want to test this out, this is something you could do. Off. Jump shot. So definitely check this hoe out. Make sure y'all, when y'all test these hoes, come back and let everybody else know in the comments what jump shot you like the best. Hey, I just dropped the greatest lockdown build in NBA 2K24, I'm pretty sure. Or at least the greatest template for a damn lockdown. So make sure you click the video, go watch it right now, check it out. But hey, hey, here we go again, yeah, here, here we go again, people talking this for when this hit the fan, everything I'm that made me, now break it down, yo, off the top of the dome, dome.